Hi there! My name is Monica Walsh and I'm an actor and writer from St. John's, Newfoundland and I would very much like to attend the Copycat Academy happening um, at the end of June in honor of David Cronenberg's novel Consumed. Um, I will tell you a little bit about my upcoming project. It's a film that I wrote and I'll star in and produce called Lamenting Pluto and I wish to attend the Academy both for my growth as an artist, but also in an attempt to learn a little bit more for the sake of the film about the definition, about the purpose of the term meaning, and what does meaning mean to us as human beings. So this video will address the phrase, we can't worry about meaning, meaning is a consumer item from Cronenberg's new novel. Um, the novel right now is on order for me here in St. John's. Uh, they didn't have a copy of it. So that's exciting. I'm waiting to read that and I look forward to that. In the context of my film, the film has to do, it's called Lamenting Pluto. It has to do with a young woman. It opens uh, upon her at the demise of her relationship. So her long-term relationship has ended. She is very sad, but at the same time, this film takes place in 2006, at the same time as her relationship ends, Pluto loses its status as a planet. And she can't deal with this. She has a bit of a breakdown because she can't accept that the years she spent thinking of Pluto as her favorite planet are now meaningless, in her words. So I wish to examine this. So I found a couple of definitions of the word meaning. I chose three that I liked. So we have noun. What is meant by a word, text, concept, or action? We have adjective. Intended to communicate something that is not directly expressed. I like that one a lot. And this one is my favorite. Noun. The end purpose or significance of something. So I think that's interesting. So in the film we have two meanings. We have the meaning, uh, well actually we have three. We have her obsession over the meaning of Pluto in her life. The character also builds her own solar system. And this project is a lovingly taken, it's an obsession. She builds a solar system in her living room and this becomes her day-to-day -day life and it jeopardizes her her work, her friendships, her health. So what is the meaning of the solar system to her? And also the third meaning, the metaphor of the relationship. What's the meaning of the relationship? So in terms of the meaning of Pluto, it feels consumer-ish to me that she would obsess over what does Pluto mean to me. Again, it comes back to the self. Not so much what does Pluto mean to Pluto or the scientific community or the rest of the planet, but what does Pluto mean to me? I'm the one that thought of Pluto for years and years as my favorite planet. Now it's no longer a planet. What does that mean to me? Her made up solar system that she spends hours and hours and hours building and paper mache and paint and glitter and everything. Again, there's a consumer tint to it because it's something that she made with her hands, but it's an object. So this is mine and the perfection that she gives to it, it's sort of a comment on could why can't she picture that in her head? Why does she have to make something that she can hold and then put on a pedestal and look at every night versus the real thing, which is better, no? But because we're so used to getting things and acquiring things, she builds her own so that she can have her own solar system. And Pluto is obviously very heavily... Um, made up in her solar system. So then we can look at her, the metaphor, her relationship. Um, I think we've all been consumed by relationships. She's been consumed by the breakup, which sort of sparked her on a maybe negative mental place, and then Pluto's diminishing status sort of made that worse. So now she's consumed by a cause. It's given her sort of a reason to get up in the morning. It's given her something to focus all of her energy on. Um, that consuming passion that comes 
that takes over us when we have an obsession. That's what she's going through right now. So the meaning of Pluto in her life, the meaning of her solar system, the meaning of the solar system that I will make because I'll be the artist in the movie. So what does that mean to me? The meaning of the, the metaphor of her relationship. These are all things I wish to explore that I think will make the film stronger when I do come home and shoot it after attending the Copycat Academy. And to find the, a certain abstract artistic way of examining what meaning means to us as human beings. I think that will make my work richer and stronger and I will continue to make my solar system for the film. Thank you.